Hi Aries, this is a tarot spread called The Eyeball. The Eyeball from the Zombie Tarot. It is that spread right there. And I've already pulled them because the first time that I tried to film this, um, some bees like came into the area to the point where like one would come and then there was three bees and so I had to move it and I had to do something all over again but so the knight of cups there in the middle of the top that represents the last the previous month and the knight of cups is somebody could be a uh, could be a Pisces Cancer Scorpio a water sign somebody that's adventurous moody and I have to, very romantic person. Then for your current issue, we have uh, over this whole month, we have the Five of Cups. The Five of Cups is, um, in, this, in this deck, it's really about sadness, grief, loss, and sorrow. So I'm gonna clarify that Five of Cups. We have Four of Cups, Four or Five, oh my gosh. That's crazy. So, Four of Cups is about, um, you know, getting complacent, feeling um, like there's not much else for you to do in a situation because of some loss or regret, something that you can't go back on. But those are just the energies presented this month. Doesn't mean that you have to get stuck in them. And it doesn't, it also doesn't mean that you can't alchemize them. So your job would be to get this energy and change it, alchemize it, be the magician. So your first week of October, you have the Ace of Cups which is new beginnings in a relationship. Some people are definitely having a child, news of a child, birth of a child, um, <laughs> most definitely. Um, so that would, that would actually be something pretty good to deal with, right? So that's the first week. The second week is the Nine of Hazards, or um, as you probably know that as Nine of Pentacles. And, the Nine of Pentacles comes out when we're reminded how strong and independent we can be. So, um, you know, we, that we can be dependent on ourselves for things that we need. And I'll clarify the Nine of Pentacles. The Lovers, okay, had to make a big choice. So, the Lovers is about big decisions. So, this is, okay, this is different things. This can be somebody really cutting off a relationship, ending a relationship, and them being independent, and knowing they can be independent. Or, it's about, or it could be about taking care of what you have with another person but still both kind of independently putting in the work. If that makes sense, I guess 50-50. So, two of cups, we definitely have a relationship. We got two of cups for the third week. Oh, that's good. And so the two of cups is about, you know, relationships and um, partnership, cooperation, and the Ace of Pentacles is about a new beginning and some kind of um, material, something that has material gain, a venture like that. So on your fourth week in October, you have Knight of Pentacles. That's the slow moving, um, that's the slow moving knight in the deck. But they're slow and, you know, they're determined, they're sturdy. They win the race eventually and that's clarified by the seven of ones it's all about having to um, to kind of defend yourself be on the defensive so this though is your projection prediction sorry for um, next month the month that so for November and it's the ten of cups 
and it's absolutely the best card pretty much that you could want it's got emotional and material happiness so I hope you like that thank you and thank you for um, those of you that have liked or shared or subscribed I appreciate it thank you